On behalf of Mayor Lee, I welcome each and every one of you, and I hope you'll listen closely to those who will be following me, because they will be walking through the nature of what this city is prepared to do, just in case. Thank you. Today, EBI is hosting the 2017 Earthquake Safety Fair here at the Phil Graham Civic Auditorium. Now, we have five free seminars today, and they will cover the permit process, construction, and most important, we have a September 15, 2017 deadline for Tier 3 retrofit requirements under the mandatory seismic retrofit program. Well, today we had a workshop on the San Francisco soft story mitigation program, and there's 1,600 uh, property owners that have yet to submit for their permit, and there's a deadline coming up this September 15th to do so. So we all know there's a large earthquake uh, predicted by the U U.S. Geological Survey coming in the next 30 years that will be larger than Loma Prieta or Northridge, and these soft story buildings are particularly vulnerable because they have no walls at the ground floor to resist these seismic forces. The fair is a, an excellent sort of one-stop shop for our residents uh, and community members to prepare themselves and to even be safer than they currently are. I applaud the Department of Building Inspection for putting this together again. We have multiple agencies represented, including the San Francisco Fire Department. The message really that we're trying to push is how important it is to be prepared. The more our residents are prepared, the more streamlined the response will be from public safety and the more expeditiously we'll be able to get into the recovery mode. This event is including people to learn how to prepare themselves, especially the public, homeowner or tenant to see what they can prepare for the next major event like the earthquake, fire and then this fair we are including 120 tables there's all the city departments and also contractor, architect, engineer, all of them will educate them how to prepare themselves. Today we had our workshop going over permits, how to obtain permits, and what to look for on job cards and plumbing and electrical permits. A lot of people seem more engaged in the process and are looking forward to actually getting permits and inspections in the future, and that's exactly what we're looking for. Hi, my name's Fernando Juarez. I'm with the San Francisco Fire Department, and we talked about home escape planning, smoke alarms, carbon monoxide alarms, calling 911. It was a great fair, a lot of people attended it. So during the workshop, we were able to cover the definition of ADUs and whether or not they were right for a property owner and their property. We covered what, uh, where in the city the ADU may be eligible to build, as well as some of the basic planning code requirements and optional waivers, um, as well as the processes. The purpose of our workshop today was to help uh, navigate the building department. We talked about things like the benefit of getting a permit, as well as the other agencies involved in reviewing permits. Preparedness is everything, and, and we all have heard the mantra, it's not if it's going to happen, it's when. We earn our resiliency by being prepared, and this fair actually gives everybody the tools that they need to be resilient, and it's really, really important. I, that uh, we all take advantage of that. I would encourage everyone to go to sf72.org. We we're asking everybody to be prepared to basically take care of yourself for 72 hours. And sf72.org will help you with some tips on preparedness so you can do just that. Let's not wait until disaster happens. Let's make sure we prevent it. And this is what DBI is all about. It's what all the other collaborative agencies are doing. It's what a resilient city does for its residents, is make sure we do the things early, do them well, and it's all free. And information should be free, and we should do it the right way, and we should make sure everybody gets this opportunity to do it.